Hello everyone, what's up and welcome to another vlog. Today is a Friday. I absolutely love Fridays and I mean who doesn't love the weekend? So I wanted to pick up the camera and bring you along for a weekend with me. So it's going to be a very eventful weekend because one of my best friends from skating is coming to visit me for the weekend. She's been on a few of the vlogs. I also did the study abroad program in London with her back in like 2018 or something like that. So she is coming to visit me from Syracuse, New York. That is where she lives. And we used to train together both in Jamestown and also in Buffalo. So I have not seen her in like a year and a half and I'm so excited for this weekend. It has been a hectic day from the second I woke up. I have been going nonstop. I did a lot of errands today. I went to the rink, all sorts of stuff. But now it's like... 5.52, that's the exact time at the moment. Nikki is taking a train in because the weather wasn't so great. She was supposed to drive here, but she made a last minute decision just to take the train because the roads are not so great. Um, it's been snowing the last like three days. So I have to pick her up at the train station in like 45 minutes. And I bought stuff to make a charcuterie board. So I want to head downstairs put that together and prepare that so when she arrives to my house, we can have a little a little appetizer. Here's what we're working with. I got two types of cheese. So we have Asiago and pepper jack. We have some pepperoni, some hummus, some olives here, and then we have a few different types of crackers to go with everything. So I'm gonna just try and make this board look cute. I wanna know what you listen to when you lay in bed alone you got this running out of space so we're getting a bigger board we're upgrading much nicer we have our hopes and our dreams every little thing between maybe this can be i bet don't know that you gave me through the moonlight the board is finished. I didn't get a ton of cheese because it's just the two of us and my parents, but I think it looks half decent. I mean, it's not the most amazing work of art, but it's gonna taste oh, good. Yeah, it looks nice. Wishing you were here, we I've, I don't know where to pick her up. I've never been here. Oh, okay, this is pretty self-explanatory. We're here! Hi! Hey. Oh my, sorry guys, I just fell into the car. <laughs> Hello! She's back! She's been back. back! People in front of us were like, welcome to America! And I was really? like, okay. <laughs> Sorry if I smell like train. Oh, like wine connoisseur at the like wine oh. shop picked it out, so it should be good. Oh, that's fun. Nikki brought yeah. some wine. It's a nice way to find like. Looks like a pop bottle, right? Yeah. I had it in my like little backpack, and I showed it to Jordan. She's like, "Oh, is that a big soda bottle?" <laughs> There's like nothing more humbling than trying to get like a cork out of a wine bottle in front of people. <laughs> I always do that. I'm like, I'm gonna bring. We have to get our cheers, of course. Oh, did she? Oh, sorry. <laughs> she went right in. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> Interesting. You don't like it? It tastes like more like a rosé, I would say, than a Moscato, don't you think? Yeah, it's more on the rosé side, mm -hmm. and it has like a hint. I'm saying really? this as if I'm like a wine connoisseur and I know all things about wine. It looks more like a rosé, obviously. Mm -hmm. <laughs> time to get ready because we were chit-chatting and catching up but now we're gonna go to dinner we're gonna go to vice hopefully we can get a table i have not been there in a very long time i actually have only been one time but i had a great experience so <laughs> let's just take a moment for nikki's earrings i expect nothing less from her but iconic 
Love them. <laughs> they, I did it to go with the pink. This is the O O T N outfit of the night. We got an Abercrombie, an Abercrombie, an Urban Outfitters, and an Abercrombie. We love Abercrombie now. Big Abercrombie stand. Um, everybody for the vlog. Okay. Apparently, Aritzia bodysuits are very similar to Abercrombie bodysuits. So that's do what you will tip. with that info. Inside mm -hmm. scoop here from Nikki. Inside scoop. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll wear one another one for you tomorrow. That's very similar. So I have a bodysuit from Leaf, but I think I got it from Nordstrom Rack. So it's like a square <laughs> neckline. Again, big fan of green lately. And then I have these jeans from Zara. They're just straight leg and I cut them because they're too long. And my boots from I think Windsor when I worked there <laughs> forever ago. Windsor. So we, we are ready. Windsor. We are ready for dinner and drinks. have made it after a big parking debacle even though there's a thousand big. spots in this parking lot I wanted to try and cop some free street parking yeah we, it was not a success it though. was not a success but we made it it was unfortunate it's better than getting stuck on a snow bank <laughs> only five dollars I feel like that was our fate Saturday morning and we've had a really lovely chill morning so far at home had some coffee and breakfast and now we are ready to go out for the day a little day out on the town I want to take her to Elmwood Village and like Hurdle area because there's some really cute little boutiques and like vintage stores around there so that is the plan. It is beautiful outside. It's sunny out. Here is my outfit for today. I just have on this plain white turtleneck from Forever 21 with my Nasty Gale little cardigan over top. I just have some sunglasses. I think these are from Amazon. And then I have on jeans that are like medium wash from Express. <laughs> this is also a sweater from Nasty Gale. It has a little off the shoulder action. I love that. How cute. Super cute. A big slouch. And then these are from Abercrombie as well. They're a different pair than yesterday. <laughs> and the jewelry is from Starlight Vig Village. Starlight Village. And then this is also from there too. Oh, cute. To match my little ring. Oh, they're all from the same place? This place, Chris got me this one from Etsy. Oh. And then I already had this. Can I have paw? <laughs> paw, good girl. Yeah, paw. Good girl. Get it all. We are going to take some pictures. We're going to attempt to take some photos and be Insta-worthy. <laughs> we will see how it turns out. But we made, we brought an outfit change, so we're going to try and get some pictures around Buffalo. But I think we're going to stop at the park en route to our first destination. Mm -hmm. That's pit stop number one. Better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing. Shot number one, done. <laughs> Back in through the snow. <laughs> Her chunky booties. Oh my god. Not us just leaving the car on a literal street. Don't mind us. 
Don't mind us. We have to. We have to do what we have to do. Hello, Jordan's vlog. We are on our way to this boutique in Buffalo. Um, pictures were a success. Yes, pictures were a success. And yeah, we didn't like stop too many cars on their track, so I guess that was good. That's a plus. That's always a plus. And um, a little about me. I met Jordan when we were like. 13 or 14. Yeah, right. Um, when I started what training you, with her. Doing? Sorry. He's <laughs> green and he's not going. When I started training with her and our amazing coaches um, out here in Big Buff. Big and Buff. I'm from Syracuse, so we've always had quite the long distance um, friendship. So, yeah. And then we've always stayed in touch, even when she is on her cruise ships. And one of my besties for the rusty um wow, we've been what else about for me a decade like yeah. over a decade wow friends for a decade Hi. oh is this our next um Sunoco. photo location <laughs> sunoco surprise that's the local boutique yep that's <laughs> oh my gosh uh, anything else about me um she's a leo i'm a leo i went to binghamton university and I love margaritas. So <laughs> that's pretty much that's it in a nutshell. That's all there is to know. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Oh, how cute are these? I love this little tote. Parking in the city is my least favorite thing. One of my least favorite things in this world. Well, actually, parking in the city is one thing. That's already bad enough. Then add snow and poorly plowed streets. That's 10 times worse. We just circled a bunch to find a spot, but I parallel parked like a pro. She did. It was great. Not bad for not driving in nine months. I know, right? This is what we need. We need that. Moira Rose. Mm -hmm. RPG. Queen. I really like this store. So many good finds. Nikki found some candles made out of old Water. beer cans. Mm -hmm. Cute little gift. <laughs> Love. Um, a sweater dress for a wine bottle. <laughs> a sweater dress for a wine bottle? That's... That is amazing. <laughs> Cute! Our next stop! I love little greeting cards too. Frank's a lot. If you know, you know. My friend Tessa would love these stores because of all the handmade jewelry. She makes her own jewelry and she's really good at it. And there's so much handmade jewelry and it's all so pretty. I can't wait to get my whole re pierced so I can actually wear earrings again. I love these dangly earrings. So pretty. Things are going well. We've mm -hmm. bought in a few things. The boutiques are so cute on Elmwood and I love everything. So I think we're gonna get some coffee now. Mm -hmm. show you so I got this little beanie it's a buffalo beanie I thought it was really cute and then from this thin ice place I thought it was an ice cream shop or like a shaved ice place for years I've never been in but it's just a, a gift shop I got three crystals so I got 
rose quartz. This is for relaxation, inner peace, and tranquility. I also got a tiger's eye, which this one is so cool. Like, look yeah, at it. It's really great. Tiger's eye is for prosperity, good luck, belief in self, stability, and inner strength. And then the last one I got is selenite. Sel selenite? I think I'm saying it properly. This one's really cool as well. Enhances mental flexibility to enable strong decision making. A stone of truth and honesty. So, I'm very excited about these gemstones. Those are, those are my finds of the day. It was really fun to walk around. The sun is already setting. It's like 5.30. But the sky looks beautiful tonight, even though it's freezing. Oh, and Coco loves the snow. <laughs> when we picked her up, when we got her, it was winter. She is a snow pup. We have made a very quick change, freshened up our makeup, and now we are headed to dinner. We're gonna go to this place called Brightsmith Brewing. A few moments later. We have striked out so far. Actually, just strike one because there was a two and a half hour wait at Brightsmith, so <laughs> we are not doing that. But our Uber driver here is doing a great job. Thanks, thanks Joe, five stars. <laughs> we actually ate before we left. What about the brew pub? What brew pub? The Buffalo Brew Pub? Down. We could try. It's the verdict. Oh, God. She's giving us the thumbs up! <laughs> you haven't even I walked in and I am disappointed. And I don't care who knows oh, it. Block. The vibes are not immaculate. <laughs> don't mind me. Oh, what do we think, Dad? My daughter is really something. I will take that as a compliment, sir. Any other comments? No comments at this point. Where are the peanuts and the popcorn? Oh, well, that Mom has like, Mom has like a thousand dollar necklace on and she's like, give me the peanuts. <laughs> in their fish tank here. Whoa, wait, I can see that. Do you think they got popcorn and peanuts behind that thing? <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> so, sir. Here in Russell's now, we have stopped here for a drink after our dinner. 